Hey there! Today we are cleaning, decorating, and preparing the half bathroom for Christmas. In honor of Christmas coming up in a few days, thought I would give you guys a new video on how to quickly decorate and clean your bathroom for guests. Step one: make sure it smells good. Step two, start cleaning. I started with cleaning my mirror with a glass cleaner in preparation for any last minute guest. The sink got very dirty and so I used my Mr. Clean Freak all over the sink to try to clean it all up. Make sure to get in any nook and cranny that you can. Also, if you're wondering, the mirror I DIY'd with the little circular mirrors just to sort of cover up a old rusted i guess i guess i don't know if it was rusted or if it was a little damaged towards the end so i had to figure out a affordable solution to use that mirror and kind of cover up what i don't want visible here is a close-up of the mirror and as you see the glue gun was just used to put the mirror together and yes they do fall time to time but it's definitely most majority of it has held up well and i'm just covering up and retouching that one spot so how many of you all dread cleaning the toilet because i think that is my number one least favorite task to do in terms of cleaning the house I just, I, I, I hate it. I cannot stand it. And well, ladies, we're going to have to do it because we want a clean toilet to sit on. The Clorox bleach is my favorite brand to use when cleaning up the toilets. Sorry if this is making you cringe, but the next part is decorating. So the fun part is coming up. You. So this is from Michaels and we're going to put that in the narrow portion of the circular framework that we are working with and so is this snowflake. The circular framework is, you guessed it, big lots and so is the photo frame but these lovely glittery acorns that we're using are also from Michaels. And literally, you can probably DIY them yourselves and get plain old acorns and just put Mod Podge and glitter to get this look yourself. Now we are getting the sink area ready. I love to only add a few items here and there. And we stuck to blue because the painting in the background is blue. So I wanted to make sure to kind of have that in there. And now for this towel... This I purchased from TJ Maxx. It was a little bit on the expensive side. It's $12.99 for these two towels, which I personally think are sort of expensive, especially at TJ Maxx. But they were well worth the price because they are very good quality. Decorative towels always do the trick, especially in a small space like this. I ended up using both the towels and just overlaying it to make it have more of a luxurious type of look and feel to it. I thought it added nice layers to it. Now we have a cute little basket from Dollar Tree that we are just putting in the item. That was the frame that I was talking about that goes so well with this frame. And here's sort of the overall look and a close-up of all the items used for this half bathroom. This is also one of the most used bathrooms in, in our home. Comment down below if you already started decorating your bathrooms. I truly hope this inspires you to clean and decorate your bathroom for this holiday season. All you need is effort to make it work. Until next time, my friends.